Morning everyone. Happy Thursday. You're waking up this morning with a little bit of wind. In fact, as you take a look at the camera already shaking about right now with the gust just about 30 miles per hour here in the metro area. That's a sustained wind at 21. Now the feel like temperature. That's what to focus on. Even though we're sitting above average 22 is that feel like temperature this morning. So here are the latest wind gusts statewide again between about 25 and 30. Now as we get into the afternoon, these winds will increase just a little bit. We could potentially see gusts around 35 to 40, even up to around 45 miles per hour. Uh, the highest gusts still expected to be mainly uh, north of Highway 20. So the National Weather Service did keep a uh, wind advisory beginning at 9 this morning through 5 o'clock today. Now, even though central and southern Iowa not in that wind advisory, still expect a pretty windy day for today. Now, your temperature is waking up this morning, upper 20s to lower 30s, but you factor in those winds again, feeling like the teens in Algona, even Mason City, lower 20s there for you in Grinnell and Creston waking up with your feel like temperature of 20 degrees. So we have an upper level trough uh, that's basically setting in the upper part of the Midwest. So what we're doing is we're getting a counterclockwise flow there. There are some clouds that are also filtering in uh, around this upper level trough too. So if you live in north and northeastern Iowa, some of these clouds are going to start to make their way in this morning into the afternoon, and I can't rule out maybe even a few flurries possibly uh, as these clouds pass through for central and southern Iowa. I think we're going to stay mainly sunny for today. Now as we take a look at the future cast here, you'll be able to see this going through the morning into the early afternoon. Some of these clouds are wrapping around again, maybe a few flurries or a brief snow showers a slight chance of that but if you're looking out the window there in Mason City and see that just know I put that in the forecast for you even out towards Fort Dodge and Waterloo for further uh, farther south and west again I think it's going to stay mainly sunshine for today as we go through the overnight hours sky stay mostly clear waking up tomorrow morning it should be a pretty nice sunrise maybe a few clouds also working in for tomorrow for uh, the northern part of the state again the main weather topic today will be the wind now the wind gusts will continue to get quite gusty during the afternoon hours here's about two o'clock still seeing uh, the winds potentially up to around 40 to 45 miles per hour. We could have isolated areas with higher gusts. So again, you have the trash cans out, maybe some of those decorations still want to go ahead and secure them or maybe put them away just to be on the safe side. Overnight tonight will remain on the breezy side, but the winds will start to lighten up through tomorrow morning. I think they'll generally be between about 15 to 25 miles per hour. So the forecast for today, we will be above average, but with that wind, it's going to feel a lot colder. Here's that extended forecast. We stay quiet and wild through the weekend. We start to see that change coming Sunday night with a chance of maybe a little wintry mix into Monday. The best chance 39 for that high and then behind that we have a sharp cold front that really co cools us off to begin 2017 Wednesday and Thursday with highs between uh, 16 and 18 degrees. Ray